Hello everyone, Shadow Hollow here, welcome to my channel. And today, during the developer showcase, they showed us quite a bit of new information, new changes that they made in Iceborne, they gave us a tour of the new base, and we got to see some gameplay of them hunting Tigrex. So in this video, I'm going to do a recap of a few things that we learned in this showcase. Starting off with the first thing, and that is that you won't reach the new base until after you reach Master Rank. My guess is that it will be after you get close to completing the story or get up to the Valkana fight in the storyline. The Housekeeper. He now has a window outside. That adjustment was made so you don't need to keep running inside your house to do things like check your Tail Raider Safari. You can now do it right there on the fly. Next, Steamwork. And there's a few things that I want to talk about this. First of all, the Steamwork is a new feature where you will deliver fuel and in return get to participate in a minigame where you can gain items as rewards. You can get this fuel throughout the course of you going on quests and getting items. Once you deliver this fuel, you have to put in inputs to fill a gauge and how well you put those inputs will determine the type of items that you get. Once you fill the gauge, a cutscene will happen and you will receive a haul of good items. Now some of the items that they showcased were completely new to world. Apparently we will get dust of life, which if I remember correctly are basically life powders that heal even more. So that will be a nice addition for you and your teammates. And then we have king armor spears, which I assume will be better than heavy armor spears since you can now get those during this mini game, whereas before you can only get those during festivals. And they most likely added these because the level that you can level up your armor in Iceborne will go up. Currently, you can only level up your armor to level 11 and master rank armor will be higher than that. Next, they added a new view mode. You can now look around and take better looking screenshots for social media or whatever you choose to use it for. Along that, they now have an option for you and your palico to do poses, so you can use that along with the new view mode and take awesome pictures. You can use the view mode during hunts and I'm sure some of you will try to use it while you're in the middle of a hunt with a monster coming straight at you. I would recommend that you don't do that, but I'm pretty sure I'll be wasting my time here. You can now change Pelico armor, your armor, and load in quest or load in quest with your friends all from the character select screen, which is a nice addition. Now here's a big one. Quest difficulty is now more precise. There is now a difficulty level for two players, a difficulty level for three players, and so on. And not only that, but if a player joins your quest and then leaves, the difficulty level will actually readjust itself depending on how many players are left. So no more people joining in, making your quest harder, and then leaving you to sit there and actually try to finish that harder quest. And the last thing that you should know, and that is that you can jump off raider rides and attempt a jumping attack. So I'm pretty sure we'll see some raider ride to mount situations in game pretty soon. And that's pretty much it guys. Now they will be releasing new information later on. And when they do, I will be updating my YouTube page or my website at www.hollowpeakgaming.com. Dot com. So if you uh, have not visited my website or if you uh, want to be updated, make sure you follow me on Twitter because that's pretty much when I post. Uh, that's where I notify everyone um, whenever I put up a new YouTube post or a post on my website. But as of right now, I'm going to let the Tigerats hunt play out if you have not seen that. Um, it was basically just the developers during the showcase hunting a Tigrex. So if you want to see that, stick around. Be sure to subscribe if you have not done so for more videos that I have coming along the way. And make sure you hit the notification button to get notified for whenever I post. But with all that's been said and done, I will now take my leave. But until next time, just remember, I am nothing more than a figment of your imagination. Or am I? I am Shadow Hollow. Fading out, and I will see you guys in the next video. New mode on the hot spring. So does hot. There's some real action going on kind of my screen here. Right. I don't know if we want to switch over to that or keep in our <laughs> chilled out hot spring atmosphere. <laughs> okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah.
The scout flies over the Yeah, it's really a very powerful monster. You can see already Kaname's health is taking a bit of a beating. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh nice, he did a nice uh, one of those uh, clutch claw counter moves. Yeah, so he's using the clutch claw. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. The Even the game director is getting that close to being fainted. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is pretty dangerous. Ryozo is saying it like he's just discovered for the first time. Like, hey, this is, this is tough. <laughs> so is Ryozo uh, on the way there or more photos? He's kind of still on his way. He okay. looks like he's that hunter who ends up gathering herbs and mining for ores while the other guys are taking all the heat. So. Yeah. We see the Tigrex with the with his face scarred up. Uh, that's one of the properties of one of the clutch claw attacks. Yeah, yeah Ryozo has joined, so they're both on oh. the scene. Nice. Uh, <laughs> Are we gonna take a photo before uh, starting this quest? Sorry. <laughs> He's not even listening. Oh, so okay. Just making sure, you know. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 Ryozo's like, I'm just gonna go over here now. What's that? 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 Okay. So it looks like you can call them uh, anytime it's safe, right? Yeah, as long as you're not in combat, you can see here we go into combat, so it was cross hot. But while that item is accessible, you can use it to call the raider, and it'll bring you, uh, it'll follow the monster you're already attacking and get you there. So nice. And we got a mount there, we also said mounted the uh, monster, so let's see what that looks like. Yeah. So you, we've seen some clutch claw action where he's using the clutch claw to grab the of the monster to attack it, but the classic bunting attack is also still possible, as just with world, so we can still join Yeah. Alright, now everyone can get in there. Do some serious damage, as the handler said. Where did you go? Kaname looks to be uh, trying to handle Tigrex's hand. So um, while you're doing the, the raider ride, you can actually jump off of it and transition directly into a jump attack to try and get down more. Yeah, the attack. Oh, there with the Oh, and the attack. Wow. Um, yeah, like as we were kind of saying before, but whenever he gets on there with the clutch claw grapple, he can soften up the monster's hide, and that means that the same spot will take more damage later. Nice. And you can actually see the, uh, the scars there. Yeah, the damage. Yeah. Pro tips for anyone who playing the game here today, later this week as well. You can see Ryozo is going to use the slinger even with his weapon on sheath, which is a new feature. Yeah. It's quite convenient, huh? Yeah, Tigrex is... Yeah, it's like we were just saying, like you could actually see on his face the part which he previously attacked with his clutch claw grapple, so that's a signifier to the other hunters in your party if you have them, to be like, I've already you know, softened up this part, let's focus on that and do extra damage. Nice, nice block, by the way. 
Yeah, so they are in the new two-player specific difficulty, yeah, but them, I'm still not quite sure if they'll be able to finish this one by themselves. Let's see. <laughs> Nothing to do with the photos from earlier. <laughs> yeah, Kaname is just slightly dissing Ryozo now for having wasted time with the camera and then blaming, blaming him. So, yeah. Well, regardless, T-Rex is still a very tough monster, so... It's tough to keep attacking him all the time when you know that he can counter at any moment. Yeah. So, yeah, you can see that he's using items, he's like, he can sharpen and stuff while he's still on the move, so... <laughs> yeah, Rizzo's jealous of Kaname's sweet ride because he's the one who's left running by himself. So. Oh, he didn't pick up the tool? No. <laughs> Someone else showed up. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Ryozo's like, nope. <laughs> Ryozo's just noping on it because there's another monster coming out. Oh, yeah. Wow. Which monster is that? That is the Bombaro. The Bombaro is a, a root wiper. One of the denizens of the Horfrost Reach. So that's another uh, new monster, right? Yes, it's a brand new monster. Uh, it, it, it can get a little bit territorial, so if it sees another monster or anything down the back hand, it'll, it'll engage. So. Uh oh, what's happening with Tigrex here? Yeah, Tigrex is starting to lose his stamina. Right? Get tired. Yeah. Oh, Tigrex! Yeah, Bumbaro, Bumbaro, Bumbaro. Oh, Bumbaro, 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 I assume they're going uh -oh. to translate all these out and no and <laughs> darn and shoot. So you can use your imagination for that. Well, yes, I think it comes across very clearly what they're <laughs> trying yeah. to say. When they're saying, yeah, 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 no, 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 no. So fill, it, fill it in yourself, you know. <laughs> all right, real the sun, are you doing okay? See the health drop in there? Oh, oh man. Careful. Very dangerous to, to do a close call attack. Right oh, no! Oh, he fainted! Uh, wait. So, wait, he didn't faint? No, no, what he got up there. Yeah, this is a new um, Calico Hunter tool. Nice. But if you use it only once, but well, just when you're about to faint, they'll, they'll be able to help you on you back some health. Mind is on business. Right, right. Ooh. Yeah, it looks like Bombaro left, so but then uh, it also left the cigarettes pretty angry. Oh, and another mount. Nicely done. Let's see if you can bring him down. Stand up. Oh, oh no. fell in the vine traps there by the Nice. Well, good spacing there to land all those big big hits.
Rails <laughs> always used to his own <laughs> custom shortcut setup, so <laughs> since it's a sort of a default <laughs> one in this um, event build, he's blaming that for oh, okay. the situation. Oh, well, that's fine. That's I'll okay. allow it. Oh. Jokas up there got there super fast. Yeah, he was using the, the rider, so. Okay. Alright, perfect wake up call over here. Okay, here we go. Nice. Let's just pound on it, this is going to be the last stretch. So. Yeah. Oh, he's got a gangrene. Yeah. It's all or nothing there. Oh, that was a really nice uh, step counter there. Oh, yeah. oh, there we have it. Oh, give it up for Ryoza Tsujimoto and Karabu Fujioka. Well done. Yeah. 